Welcome on this new video. Today, let's have a look on the Planetware Explorer module. It's a really convenient way to design and share reportings, dashboards, and KPI in all the Planetware modules. Let's first construct the queries. Queries are used to build the dashboard. In this example, we'll create a load array and a histogram chart. In the design mode, we add the dimensions we need. Let's choose the resource dimension. Then, we add a measure is the data we want to see in the table. Here we can select the estimated completion, which can be displayed in several units. For this demo, we're going to select the dollar unit. We also need a time window for this table. Let's take a five years window. We choose to display the five next years, starting from the date of the day, with any time period you wish. In this example, we are going to select the year. Once those components are created, we simply drag and drop them into the corresponding area of the query. For instance, to create a load array, we use the time component as the column axis. We can follow the automatic building of the query after each new component. We can also add filter on the data we want to display. Let's show the fourth level or our resource breakdown structure in this example. Now we are going to create a new chart showing the same data as previously. For this second query, let's do simple. We'll save this query as a new one and modify it. To do so, in the right side of the toolbar, we have different query types available. For the purpose of this demo, we'll display a histogram instead of the table chart. As you can see, the chart is instantly displayed in the screen. Now, let's create the dashboard using both queries we built earlier in this demo. To design it, we simply drag and drop the queries in the whiteboard in the position we want. It's possible to move and resize each element as you wish. Many other tools are available to adjust the position of each element. Something useful we can add here is a dynamic filter to allow each user to only display the data he needs. Here, for instance, we add a filter on the resources. Finally, let's see the result of our dashboard by switching to the presentation mode. As you can see, the filter zone makes it easier to select which department we want to see. In this example, we selected the defense and landing system department. Thank you for watching this video.